So, Pixie, do you feel like there's a place for women in history, or are they just um, left out? Uh, I'm sorry, um, Pixie, we're interrogating you. Jeffrey, we're interrogating her. I think we should stop. Uh, no, it's, um, it, it's fine. I just... I just didn't come prepared to. Oh, of course, right? Of course you did. I, I, I'm sorry, uh, Pixie. Uh, just, just one more question, and if you don't mind, and and then we'll talk about your your essay. Uh, uh, what was the question? Jeffrey, this is getting a little heavy-handed. The question was, um, is there a place for women in history? Well, from the lectures and the textbooks, I would say. No, women don't have a place in history, but I don't know if I believe that. Well, what do you believe? Is this about my essay? All right, we've asked our questions. I think we should stop now before Pixie begins she, to- No, she wants to answer. I'm, I'm sorry, is there just some reason why Pixie can't offer a response? <laughs> Pixie, could you, <laughs> could you just leave the call for, for a minute? <laughs> I'm so uh, sorry. Uh, no, Pixie. Um, Professor, why? <laughs> why can't Pixie answer the question? You can answer, Jeffrey. It's not a question of whether or not she can answer. Then? I have no objections to hearing Pixie's response. Then good. I'm Let's... afraid that we're overburdening her. With, with one question. Pixie, I'm sorry. <laughs> if you could just leave the call for one one short moment and, and then we'll uh I, I don't I don't see why Pixie should leave the call while, while we and I are <laughs> in the midst of uh, your essay raised a number of questions. About women and their underrepresentation in the historical record and and Pixie, your essay interests us in yep. that it speaks to the deficit of female figures as I well as history of our and our argument the student affairs. Extend it into it's about her her essay is the subject of the argument. Thank you, Pixie. It will just be one moment. Okay. 